What should you do when you get bitten in Project Zomboid? Let's be honest with ourselves, you are eventually going to get bitten. It's just part of the game. Heck, even the game tells you that you're going to die every time you load in. So what do you do when one of these pesky little hooligans bites a chunk out of your face? Well, if you get bitten in this game, you are 100% going to die, there is no doubt about that. But the bite will not kill you instantly. It will slowly kill you over a few days, and during that time, it may seem wise just to make a new world and start over, but that's not always the best option. In most games when you die, it's usually a game over and you restart, but not in Zomboid. One thing I love about this game is that when your character dies, you can just come back into the same world with a new character. All your skills and progress will be reset, but the physical world is still the same. Everything you have built, looted, and destroyed will still be there. And that means that your hard-earned loot is still somewhere out in the world. And most likely, it is on the back of a rotting corpse that is wandering around the world. But that rotting corpse was you, and now since that character is dying due to a zombie bite, he has now become a zombie himself. And that's why when you get bitten, you should make it as easy as possible for your new character to be able to get your loot back. If your character turns into a zombie outside, he will be able to wander wherever he likes, meaning it will be much more difficult to find your loot. So when you get bitten and you fear that your time is coming to its end, be sure to die inside a building or in a fenced-in area where the zombie version of you can't freely wander around. Just make sure that the old you doesn't kill the new you. Huh. I don't know why, but that sounds kind of poetic. But anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.